Welcome back to a new HBAR Hedera analysis. And yesterday we've broken this parabolic uptrend here. What is next for HBAR? What is the critical support to hold? I will talk about all of these things in this important video. This is the four hourly time frame for HBAR Hedera. And basically from off the 27th of March, we had a significant rally to the upside. As a matter of fact, this was a rally of approximately, let's say it correctly, 37% to the upside. Parabolic move here. We were respecting this parabolic curve here in white, but yesterday we broke, uh, yeah, we, we have broken down basically. And right now we are trading at the seven cent region. So what is next for HBAR? Well, if we break to the downside further from off this point, then of course the support below us is 6.9 cents. We have already bounced from it slightly, but if we go back again, I do expect some support here, but uh, most likely if we will go down again to this level, we will fail to hold it as support. And then the next support for HBAR is located at 6.6 .6 cents. And if we lose that one as well, there is very strong support located at 6.4 cents, which is the golden Fibonacci ratio, the 0.61 in confluence with the 200 day moving average here on the four hourly time frame so if we break down you know the areas of support stronger support here around the 200 200 day moving average here in orange and um, yeah if we go higher from off this point then the resistance to break first of all is located around seven dollars and 35 cents but uh, eventually we need to break above seven uh, sorry seven cent, uh, seven point seven cents if we break this level to the upside then i do expect a lot of upside continuation but yeah as i stated yesterday we had a significant bearish rsi divergence we had lower highs here on the four hourly rsi and the price was forming this higher high structure classical bearish divergence played out we saw a move to the downside i have to say the move to the downside was on low volume and the move up was on high volume so i still think that the bulls are in control and this is just a healthy pullback for hbar and uh, eventually i do expect this uptrend to continue so let's zoom out a little bit let's go to the daily time frame and let's give the new subscribers a brief recap so this is the daily time frame for hbar my view is basically that the bear market low has been made at the end of december at 3.5 cents i don't see us breaking this level anymore it's very unlikely unless an extreme black swan event will occur in the market but otherwise i think uh, we are are not going to visit this, these levels anymore since then we had a strong move to the upside of five wave structure i'm labeling this as an elliott wave one impulse for hbar and uh, the top was reached on the 12th of february at approximately 9.8 cents since then we corrected down in an a wave we had a b wave to the upside and a c wave a long c wave to the downside to complete this elliott wave two correction which was most likely completed on the 10th of march 2023 at 5.4 cents since then we were moving to the upside came down and we saw a big move again a few days ago uh, right now we are retracing a little bit but i think overall we are in a strong uptrend we are potentially in this third elliott wave to the upside i'm also going to give you the price target so if we take the length of this first impulse and if we place this trend based fib tool on the bottom of the wave two at the bottom of the wave two we are looking for the 1.618 fib extension which is located at 15 cents and this is my minimum target for this wave three we could even extend a lot higher all these targets could be reached by hbar in the next few weeks and months um yeah but as i said the minimum is 15 cents for this third elliott wave you can also see that uh, hbar broke above the 200 day moving average here on the daily time frame on the 20th of january we even got a back test here as support here back in march and also at the end of march here and right now we bounced strongly from it so in my opinion uh, hbar is very bullish and as long as we can hold above the 200 day moving average in orange i think that uh, this uptrend will maintain and that's my view on hbar adera please like the video subscribe to my channel i want to thank you guys for watching and i see you in the next video bye bye